There's a program in Western Massachusetts that saved the lives of thousands of cats. Cats who just a few years ago would have been rounded up and euthanized. But now they're returned back to the wild with a caregiver or else adopted. The program's called TNR. One day in Agawam, Nancy Stefano looked outside her window and saw a cat colony, a mother and six kittens. So she called the Dakin Humane Society. She set out traps. She said these are um, community cats. They have a mother, but no one really owns them. I will take them in and uh, have them TNR'd. That means that we're going to get them spayed or neutered and give them some shots. And uh, we'll try to adopt them out because they seem to be young enough. TNR stands for Trap Neuter Release. It's a program to manage the cat population, replacing a previous program that would catch and kill feral cats. At that time, one of the things that I found out that was very shocking to me was that the MSPCA, the local MSPCA, was euthanizing approximately 9,000 cats a year um, as a form of population control. They've been doing that for like 50 years, and it obviously wasn't working. The Trap Neuter Release program is working, though because for the first time in years, Western Massachusetts's cat population is stabilizing instead of growing. So far, Massachusetts has the distinction of having, we, we actually have shelter capacity left over. They're actually importing cats from other states because they have capacity. There's people looking for kittens and there aren't any. If you're interested in finding out more about TNR, either become a volunteer or because you know of a cat or colony that could use the service, there's more information on the Dakin Humane Society's website. Reporting from Northampton, this is Justin Marsh.